great. Terrific! Don't tell me what happened. I want to see it. Samson was crying like a baby. Oh, well, you see, the ball left the field and hit the blades of a passing traffic helicopter. And... Greetings and salutations. No, stop. Stop! Many people are dying to know what's next for the Adventures in Odyssey series. Well, today we're going to give you a sneak peek into what the Odyssey creators have been up to. Over 60 people take part in an Odyssey recording session. In May of 2009, six brand new shows were recorded, including the first episodes of Album 51. Recording happens in a studio, and in a studio, everything starts with the director. The director has a lot of different jobs in the studio. One thing that's very important, especially when you're establishing new characters, is to uh, figure out how they're going to sound. These actors have a lot of different voices, so you want to get just the right voice for the character. Well, 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 another guest. How delightful. Oh, my, my. Well, 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 another guest. How delightful. Oh, my, my, my. Well, well, another guest. How delightful. Oh, my, my. The role of the director in the studio really is to sort of manage the studio time, to, to, to work with the actors, to help them to draw out the best performances. You know, the actors that we work with are great and really come prepared for the, uh, for the session. But they don't know the script as well as the director does, who's kind of poured through it and gone through all of the drafts and whatnot. And he knows exactly what we need, both from a performance perspective and from a sound design perspective. Oops, my bad. And there's another one! Little Miss Butterfingers, that's me! And here goes another one! And another! There! Are you happy? Had enough? Now how about those orders? Are you ready for me to fix them? Yeah, that's what I thought! Okay, all right, good. A little rough, but, but it's good. Other than that, I think the main job is uh, get out of the way and let the actors really uh, perform the characters and give them advice when needed, but also know when to pull back and say, no, this is more the actor's choice more than the uh, uh, something that has to be in the, in the line reading. Which I'll tell you a little bit later in today's show. And now, let's hear the Washington family try to survive a night at a restaurant in... My favorite thing. Right now we have um, about three directors. There's uh, Paul McCusker, who's directed many of the shows and has directed the shows for over 20 years now, so very experienced with directing the actors. Uh, Dave Arnold directed a few of the shows this last session, and he's also been with Odyssey for many years. He hasn't directed as many Odyssey shows, but he's directed a lot of radio theater shows and also very experienced. And then I directed one of the shows this last session. The directors and the actors are not the only people that work in the studio. Somebody has to actually record the voices. This is where the sound designer comes in. The sound designer is, is complementary to the director in that he knows what he's going to be doing in post-production. He's, he's kind of poured through the script, he's read through it, and is thinking ahead of all of the things that he has to accomplish and what the, uh, the landscape of the scene is going to mean for him. Some of the most exciting things about upcoming episodes are the new families coming to Odyssey. We asked executive producer Dave Arnold about one family in particular, the Parker family. Uh, the dad is just normal dad, uh, could be involved in in any kind of business. We don't even identify his business really. The mom comes from a Hispanic background, so eventually we'll introduce her mother who is, a, who is Hispanic. Matthew is very inventive. He likes to think things through a lot. He likes to, to try new things and, and sort of uh, work outside of the boundaries of, of life. He's he's typical boy with uh, even an extra shot of adrenaline. Olivia is your typical girl, really. She, in, in some respects, we'll, we'll see some things played out from her where she's always this, she's, she's very cause-oriented. She likes to, to pick up the cause of the week and that helps to drive her personality. Camilla, the youngest in the family, and she's very much a tomboy, loves sports, uh, has a great, you know, fun personality. <laughs> <clears throat> Hello, boys. Oh, hi, honey. Check out what... Okie doke. I should probably go ahead and shut down the train mat. Oh. What, what's going on in here? Well, what are you guys doing? Yeah. Uh, well, we were just we were just taking a break and got a little distracted. Really? Do you need help carrying all this junk out? <laughs> what? No way. This stuff is staying. Really? Mm. Oh, so if Matthew gets to keep his train in his room, then I guess I get to keep my Barbarina set. I'm taking it out of the garage sale pile. Okay, wait. <clears throat> then I can get... 
then I guess I can keep all my stuffed animals, too. Now, hold, yeah? hold on. And hold hold on. on for what? We have to be fair, right? Mm-hmm. Well, I didn't say anything about keeping the train in here. Well, my favorite part of going to California is working with all the actors. Before we get to the studio, the whole script is just lines on a page, which could work, could be very clever writing, but until you get to the studio, nothing really comes alive. So uh, the great part about being in the studio is the actors will come up with all sorts of humor that you didn't intend or didn't even think of. They'll bring that to the script. And then also jokes that you might have in the script, they can bring it to a new level. We have all kinds of actors like that. Uh, Katie, Will, Jess, they're all great at taking what's in the script and, and bringing it to a whole new level. So that's very exciting to be a part of that. What we've shown you is only a small part of what it takes to bring Odyssey to life. We hope you enjoyed this special sneak peek into what's next for Odyssey.